jobs. Last night on the Creek Turnpike, a trucker drove head on into almost certain tragedy. He escaped by inches. Craig Day has the story. Take a close look at Dennis Callista's truck. It happened so quick I didn't really know what happened at first. And you can see he's lucky to be okay. Now I've got a truck that the dash is all beat down, the windows broken. Callista was on the road earning a living when an idiot with a pumpkin tossed it off an overpass onto his truck, threatening the driver's livelihood and his life. Anger because this is my livelihood. And this is how I make my money. Luckily, it hit the dash and the hood at the same time. You know, a little higher would have hit me. While Callista escaped serious injuries, others traveling down Oklahoma highways haven't been so lucky. They didn't know what that meant to do. A couple of years ago, someone tossed a cemetery headstone off an overpass along the Cherokee Turnpike. It smashed through the windshield of Gerald Webb's truck, leaving him in critical condition and facing a long and difficult recovery. It's just awful. What George Brown says the Oklahoma Highway Patrol will spare no expense interviewing witnesses, taking statements, looking for roadside cameras, anything to get enough evidence to make arrests in these cases. What starts out is, as a prank, they go out here and they do something silly, uh, and then all of, a sudden, all of a sudden someone's hurt or killed. Dennis Callista is thankful that didn't happen to him. He says the next driver may not be so fortunate. Somebody could have got killed. I mean, if that would have hit six inches higher or something, it would have hit me right in the chest. Now, this happened near 101st on the Creek Turnpike. Anyone with information that could help in this case should call Crime Stoppers at 596-COPS. Craig Day, News on 6. You should